Severe weather unleashed its fury across multiple regions encompassing Jiangxi, Dizhu, and Guangdong, among others, prompting the escalation of rainstorm warnings to yellow status. April 18 marked a day of tumult for Guangdong province, as it found itself besieged by ferocious convective weather systems, spawning violent storms in numerous locales. The province's meteorological network, spanning over 100 weather stations, meticulously documented the onslaught of heavy to torrential rainfall, with Guangzhou's Tianhu district bearing witness to a staggering 47 mm within a scant two-hour window. As the day progressed, the ominous shroud of dark clouds enveloped Guangzhou, plunging the city into a twilight-like ambience even before the stroke of noon. A time-lapse recording captured at Guangzhou Bayan Airport offered a poignant visual narrative, encapsulating the meteoric shift in weather dynamics within a mere 10 minutes. Meanwhile, denizens of the local zoo were observed fleeing the open grasslands, seeking refuge from the impending deluge. Wow. The abrupt onset of the rainstorm caught many off guard, none more so than a local middle school where students found themselves in the throes of an abbreviated junior high school academic level physical education examination. Despite the menacing spectacle of tents being buffeted by gale force winds, candidates pressed on, cognizant of the pivotal role their scores would play in determining their high school admissions. The genesis of this violent storm can be traced to a formidable convective rain band stretching over 600 kilometers, blanketing almost the entirety of Guangdong province. Meteorological records bear testament to the deluge, with a staggering tally of over 40 weather stations across the province, logging heavy rains, ranging from 50 to 100 millimeters or more, within an eight-hour time frame, commencing at 8 a.m. Although the tempestuous nature of this convective rain band often ensures its swift departure, authorities remain wary of the lingering threat, predicting continued heavy rainfall throughout Guangdong in the coming week, with certain areas bracing for the onslaught of exceptionally high precipitation levels. Meanwhile, Jiangxi bore the brunt of convective weather phenomena, transforming daytime skies into a nocturnal tableau of darkness. Online footage captured the aftermath of potent winds, with vehicles crushed under debris, trees uprooted from their moorings, and roads submerged beneath floodwaters.
ferocity of the winds reached a crescendo, attaining a velocity of level 12, resulting in the partial collapse of the guardrail along Kaizi Bridge. In Ganzu, Jiangxi, residents emerged from their slumber to discover the disarray wrought by the elements, as kitchen roofs were summarily displaced into yards and chimneys torn asunder by the relentless onslaught of strong winds. Similarly, Gizhu found itself ensnared in the grip of convective weather, with hailstones the size of eggs pelting the ground in a cacophony of sound. Accompanied by flashes of purple-gold lightning that pierced the tumultuous skies, the hailstorm wrought havoc upon roofs and crops alike. Local residents, aghast at the magnitude of the hail, attested to its rarity within the region. As the National Emergency Management Agency maintains its vigilance, issuing yellow warning signals for strong convection on April 19, 2024, residents across southern Gizhu, central and southern Hunan, Jiangxi, central and northern Guangxi, and northern Guangdong, are urged to exercise caution in the face of thunderstorms, with intensity level 10 or above, or the looming specter of hail. In the face of such adversity, preparedness remains paramount. Against the backdrop of climate change induced fluctuations in temperature and humidity, such extreme weather events serve as a stark reminder of nature's unforgiving fury underscoring the imperative of proactive preparedness.